The laptop location is compromised. Protect it at all costs. All right, they're breaching. They're breaching. Moving in. Moving in. I got gunfire. I found the access point over here. Moving behind you. Data transfer online. Detecting hostiles. Oh. Under six, skip. All right, let's get in position for breach. Okay. Let's see if we're out. Move in, move in, move in. They're breaching the front door. Enemy down. Move it on them.
In Bow to Blood, commanding an airship takes more than just good flying and shooting. Every enemy has a unique set of strengths and weaknesses that a skilled captain can exploit by managing their crew and essence wisely. Captains have two crew members to command. With me on engines, I can keep things from overheating, giving you the chance to take us to a higher top speed. When I'm at the sensor station, I'll keep your HUD current with the latest data. I'll also jam some incoming attacks like missiles and lasers. When I'm on shields, I can remodulate and give us another layer of defenses shielding. Cool, right? When I'm in drone control, I'll send out our mashy drones to disable enemy. When I'm in the turret, I'll use the turret to shoot things. Do I really need to explain this one? Captains also have numerous essence charges that can be moved to divert power to various systems to adapt to any situation. Fire various types of specialty ammo. Use overshield to become immune to projectiles. Send out your Mashi drones to disable targeted ships and push your engines to their limit to gain short boosts of speed. And finally, no ship would be complete without the captain's trusty side. In the next video, we will be talking about managing relationships and surviving the boat.